Okay, hello. Um, right, uh, my name's Eddie. I'm just trying to show you um, Ableton Live 10. Yay, Ableton Live 10 has been released today, official release. It's it's really good. Uh, I was uh, lucky enough to be able to uh, use the beta version, and in the beta version, I discovered a known bug. Um, so this is the sequencer mode in um, Ableton Push. Um, this is your normal session mode, which shows your clips. I've just got a, a little clip loaded in there. Um, so the bug or the behavior is uh, if you set this going, well, I don't even really need to set it going, but that's the pattern. To be able to control your playhead and what part of the clip you see in and the length of the clip, you hold note here, um, and that makes this line show uh, your control and how long the clip is. Once you let go of this, that's going back into session mode. This is the behavior, this is the bug uh, that I'm trying to explain to you and I'm, I'm trying to help you out by um, doing this. I'm not sure whether they're working on it, I, I guess they are, but you know, this this might just be the, the behavior of, of the push from now on. So, yeah, you're in session mode, go to note mode. When you hold note and let go, now you go back to session. So if you want to be off of this, when you're in note mode, you need to hold session, have it come up temporarily, or you know, for as, as long as you hold that session button, your session view is going to be on the, the pusher's display or layout. Now when you let go of that, if you hold note now and let go, it doesn't take you back to the session view, you, st you stay in the note view, um, which is how I would expect um, that to work. You know, that might be a cool sort of get around for them. Um, also, I've heard that it doesn't uh, work for some other people. So, uh, well, one, one person that I, I spoke to said it didn't work for him. So, um, yeah, there you go. That's going to take me back. So I go into note mode, old session, and then, you know, there you go. And this, this note, well, holding note mode, that works, and it happens for, for all of the behaviors and all of the uh, views and stuff like that. So, yeah, if you go back into that, you can now see what part of the clip or, you know, you can now sort of see see where you are on that. But, like I say, it does, it does that. So, hold session, and then when you hold note, it doesn't take you back. Uh, so, that's it. I hope you really enjoy Live 10. Um, it, it's it's a it is amazing. It's a really good update. Wave table. That's that's um, that's a really good synth that's that's come out. I've been playing with that and liking that. Um, what I'm gonna try and do is do some more videos. I'm gonna try and do some tutorials and stuff like that. Maybe just strip it back to the absolute basics, like setting up your sound card, setting up your racks and and things like that. Um, Cause that's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm going to be going through and, you know, resetting it. It's, yeah. Right. Cool, guys. I'll leave it at that. Uh, like, subscribe, whatever, comment. I'll try and help you out if I can. Um, peace.